everybody. So today we're going to take a look at the Hario scale that I got. Now let's just go over a couple of things about the scale. Um, the scale does have the fraction of grams, which I'm going to turn on and show you. Okay. So uh, you can see that it could do 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3, and so on, all the way to 0.9. Uh, and it also has a cool feature over here for a timer. Now if you notice, notice that most uh, coffee recipes and or directions to uh, make pour over coffee. It'll tell you that you need to bloom the coffee. Now this could be, you know, 30 seconds, 45 seconds, whatever people want. And then they also have a time that you have to finish by. So this is very helpful because it's right on on the scale itself. Uh, you don't need a separate timer for it. Okay, so just want to just point out the obvious things. Uh, this scale could also tar to zero, sorry, tear to zero. And this is very helpful in measuring our beans. So if you're looking for a specific weight, I'll say this time 14, um, it makes it very easy. And you can tar it out and you can pour the water. Um, I do notice uh, something I don't like about the scale, uh, which is not too bad. Uh, I do notice that if you pour very fast, see the time it may take a couple of seconds for it to catch up so just be mindful when you're pouring water or adding liquids to this uh, not to go too fast because if you go too fast you may miss your mark all right other than that I love this scale uh, it's pretty easy to clean um, this is very um, matte surface uh, it does take some fingerprints on it so that's something you want to be aware of you can see over here in the reflection uh, it's not glossy, but otherwise it's pretty easy. To shut off, you just basically hold the button and it shuts off. Uh, it does shut off in 5 minutes and the battery it takes are two AAAs which are very easy. Alright, so if you enjoyed this review or if you have any comments or questions, just leave it below. And this is the Hario scale. Thank you.